All right, so have you ever tried to sleep on a plane? Oh, yeah, it's like, it's almost impossible. You get that awkward head bob thing going on. You're just like <laughs> exhausted, but you can't sleep. Yeah, it's just the worst, right? Uh -huh. Especially when you have a long flight and you're like, I need to get some rest. Totally. Yeah. That's what we're looking at today, the trouble <gasps> pillow. Yo, okay, yeah. And we're going to deep dive into this thing, see what the hype's all about. I've heard some good things. Yeah, we've got uh, we got a whole bunch of stuff here. We've got reviews, got some articles, even a YouTube video. Nice. Um, so yeah, let's see if this thing actually helps you sleep on a plane. Because you know, that travel sleep struggle is real. Like those U-shaped pillows, sometimes they're more trouble than they're worth. They're bulky and they never really hit the right spot. Totally. You just end up with a stiff neck feeling worse than when you started. Exactly. And that's where this travel pillow claims to be different. It's supposed to have like this internal support system, something about being ergonomic and aligning your neck. Yeah. It's kind of like a science meets comfort situation. Sounds promising, but like, does it actually work? Right, right. That's the big question. One thing that I noticed just like looking at it is it's like tiny. Yeah, it's super compact. That's awesome. Yeah. I'm all about like packing light and like, you know, you can fit it in your carry on. Exactly. Finally, a travel pillow that doesn't take up half your bag. Right. And it's not just for planes. I saw that you can use it on trains, buses, even car trips. So it's like pretty versatile. Yeah, that's a huge plus. Like, think about those long road trips. This thing could be a lifesaver. For real. For real. Yeah. But like, does it really work? Does it actually improve your sleep? Well, the reviews are pretty promising. A lot of people are saying it's helped them get better sleep, less neck strain, and even reduce jet lag. Wait, reduce jet lag? Sign me up! I know, right? It's like the holy grail of travel. But seriously, there's some science behind it. The way it supports your neck can actually improve circulation, which could theoretically help with jet lag. Interesting. I never thought about it like that. Yeah, it's pretty cool. But even if it just helps you get a little more shut eye on the plane, that's a win in my book. Absolutely. Have you, um, you've seen the YouTube video, right? Oh yeah, the one where they show you how to wear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was helpful. It seems like there's a bit of a learning curve to getting the right fit. Right, because it's not like your typical neck pillow. Well, But once you figure it out, it seems like it can make a big difference. Exactly. It's like you got to find that sweet spot where your head and neck are perfectly supported. And, you know, there are different positions you can try depending on whether you're leaning against a window or sitting upright. Makes sense. So it's not just about slapping it on and hoping for the best. You got to put a little effort into finding what works for you. Exactly. And there are tips out there for different body types and sleep preferences. Okay. So bottom line, is this thing worth it? I think so, especially if you travel a lot. It's small, it's portable, and it's designed to help you sleep better. What more could you ask for? I mean, you're right. A good night's sleep is priceless, especially when you're traveling. I'm sold. Me too. Ugh. I think it's time to ditch those old U-shaped pillows and embrace the future of travel comfort. Totally. And maybe, just maybe, we can finally say goodbye to travel-induced sleep deprivation. Something to think about, right? Definitely something to think about. Until next time. See ya!